Hi everyone, I'm back with you once again for another book. This uh, is my fifth book in the third book of the trilogy, God the Father. And this is entitled God the Father Part 3, um, A Time for a Change. This is my cover, God the Father Part 3. And in this book, you will see some changes in this syndicate family. It continues from God the Father Part 2, and you'll be introduced to seven, uh, diff several different characters who are uh, a part of the family and some of them are not but you will enjoy this book i really enjoyed writing it and uh, ending it up with a bang i hope <laughs> but i really enjoyed it and i think you will enjoy it too this book can also be uh, purchased on amazon.com and it's also in the form of the uh, kindle and you can also um read about all of my books at kfreewriting.wic.com backslash brown and you can read all the information and read the first three chapters of every book and uh, get other information that is going on with the books concerning signings and things like that and learn a little bit more about myself and my family so in this book God the Father part three God the Father Part 3 um, is the final episode of the trilogy about the Marzoni and Cardelloni syndicate family. Anthony James Marzoni, a.k.a. Alfonso Mason, has a secret in his past that could be detrimental to his life. He steps into the life of his best friend, who could have been his twin after his accidental death. He lives in Crestview Estate among people he began to love with the fear of any one of them finding out his secret. He loved only one woman, JoLynn Kennedy, yet when it came time to confess his love for her, he turns his back on her, denying his love. Another character is Amory Lamar Garrett Jr. Amory is FBI all the way. Before his father dies, Amory is giving a case which his father wanted him to crack. Amory digs into that case with the intent to take down the Cordelloni and Marzoni syndicate families. He too finds the love of his life in Ethne Rail. The two are drawn together, yet a thin line will keep them apart. Once again, the family is besieged by enemies that want to take down the family. Learn about the pillars of the Marzoni family, Alexander and Victoria Marzoni, who are Christians. The chapel that Victoria found so long ago is still a refuge and a place to speak to God. Look for a change, a new look for these syndicate families, and as always, God is in control. I hope you like this book, and once again, um, you can purchase it at Amazon.com, and also read the first three chapters of it on my website, kfreewriting.wick.com backslash brown. Have a blessed day. God bless you.